guys and welcome back to another video. Today Tunbridge Angels are at home to Dorking Wanderers in the National League South. So what are your thoughts on today's game? Uh, well I, I didn't go last week, um, which I thought wasn't quite so good. So I'm expecting reaction from the team today. Yep, yeah, Dorking one of the toughest games of the season. They're right up there. Uh, well, they're not at the moment are they? But they, they will be and they tend to be when you look down their list of players and it's, and it's quite impressive. Oh, we've got some impressive players as well so let's enjoy the game. Yeah, hopefully today should be a good game. We're playing Dorking, who obviously they're one of the favourites to uh, go up. Um, they're currently in 10th for the moment. We're in 17th, so Dorking have sort of underachieved so far this season, but they're probably on a little sticky patch or something like that. Um, obviously, we had a terrible uh, game last week at Hayden Yedding. An absolutely shocking performance. Probably one of the worst performances I think under the Steve McKibbe era, I have to say. It was that actually that bad last week. So, what's your prediction for today's game? Well, what happens when you have a game like this is if Dorky play to their best, they win. But if Dorky don't play to their best, and we do, anything can happen. And we just give the example of the Dartford game, but we could have won that one. And it could be a game like that. There'll be a reaction today, um, and, and I think we'll match them. And I think we'll come away with another point. Um, I don't think I've ever been so not confident about a game oh. ever. I, I really cannot see, see us getting anything from this game, especially after how bad last week was. My prediction is a 6-1 to Dorking, and I'll see you at Long Meet. Mum! Oh, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> he bought the club in 1999 and that's it. Come on! Oh! Good header in! Oh! Oh! Come on! Oh, we've got lucky there. 
because I love her. No, my, um, I went to Portsmouth first. Right. Oh, wow. I don't talk right if you haven't missed it. Clear it. Oh, my God. Once again, missing a header and back to in one all. Good ball in, come on. Good header. Oh. oh. Come on. Yes. Half time, it's currently Tumbridge Angels 2, Dorking Wanderers 1. So, what are your thoughts on the first half? Um, yeah, I think it's been a reaction from last week. It's been wonderful. Um, um, and Dorking don't look much, but you know, <laughs> players have really upped it. I think some of them since, so, since last week. Two lovely headers for the goals, really, really nice. A Turner shot, I don't know how the keeper kept out. Um, and um, it's, it's really enjoyable and a nice sunny day. And yeah. I think they've, they've, they've given a, a performance today that you know, they should have done after what happened last week. So really pleased so far. Yeah, I think I'm really scratching my head how we're 2-1 up here. I don't think we deserve to be 2-1 up with. I don't see any good performance We're somehow 2-1 up. But Dorking has really been been awful. Um, by their standards, they, they should be they should be smashing us, and they haven't been. And, you know, I'm, I'm I'm glad we're two one up, but we don't deserve it at all. So uh, hopefully we do end up winning in the second half. I'll see you second half. Number fifteen, Kane Willis. Come on! Oh! Come on. Oh! Come on. Oh! Go on, yes! 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 3 1 over to Avatar. That's it. There's a couple of the arrows are going on, but my God, the 3 1 up. Gorky's defence is absolutely shocking. 3 1. Come on, yes! Oh. That, that, they all they all come in. Can't believe it. James Tilly being replaced by number eight, Matthew Briggs. Oh, 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 oh. Also for Talking Mondres. Go on! Oh! Oh, go on! Shoot! 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 What? Go on! Oh! Oh dear! <laughs> That's probably a better option actually. Time it finished Tunbridge Angels 3, Dorking Wanderers 1. So, what were your thoughts on the game? Lovely result, um, best result of the season, um, and such a reaction from last week. 
Um, it was the it was the unpretty stuff that, that we did really really well today. Just winning the ball, the pressing, um, the work rate, the gamesmanship at the end, uh, the, the game management, if you like, uh, to get over the line. Um, and draw Craig to score three goals at home as well. So um, yeah, even with, with some big players missing. So really really pleased with that. Let's hope that's uh, yeah we, we we kick on. Okay, mid table now. Go from the table. Let's kick yeah. on and um, 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 and go to the top half of the table. Yeah, I thought it was an all up performance, you know. Um, I mean, it is a very good win, you know. 3 1 at home to Dorking against one of the favourites to win the league. But you know, it doesn't, I, I don't know, it doesn't feel like a win, to be honest. It doesn't feel like, I don't feel like we played that well at all. Like, uh, the atmosphere today was, was awful, you know. We should be celebrating like it won the World Cup here, and we, we haven't. Um, no, very low attendance once again, but I thought, yeah, a good win. But you know, I'm just so shocked at the lack of people and the lack of the lack of atmosphere. It's just it's not the same anymore, you know. But I didn't think we deserved to win at all. I don't. I don't think either team deserved to win. I think two or three teams out there today and we were just lucky with those mistakes but we'll take that we'll take the win let's move forward so don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you all next time bye